Hark the herald angels sing, glory to the newborn King, Jesus Christ. He is our foundation. He is our chief cornerstone. The scripture says, blessed is the nation as God is the Lord. And our constitution says, humbly relying on the blessings of Almighty God. And the role of the Canberra Declaration is to make sure it stays that way. We are making a stand together for marriage, for family, for life and for religious freedom. And without your help, we cannot do it. And yet with your help and with your prayers and with your support and financial giving, we've seen many miracles occur this year. Homosexual marriage is stalled in the Senate. We have to keep on praying, but it's stuck there in the Senate for the moment. Abortion laws that would have been very harmful to newborn children in Queensland have been stopped miraculously. Euthanasia laws in South Australia again have been stopped and stuck and just didn't get through. Same thing in Victoria where a, a bill was going to come through that was going to really discriminate against Christian education and Christian organisations stopped at the last moment. Your prayers are making a difference, your support is making a difference, many others doing great things but without you we cannot do what we are doing. Big thank you from Dave and Marilyn Rosen in Brisbane. A big thank you from Natalie Lonsdale, who looks after social media for the Canberra Declaration, based in Victoria. A big thank you to Ben and Thea Pratt, who did such a wonderful job through the marriage campaign. We One thing we would ask is please continue to pray for us. We covet your prayers, particularly for Dave and Marilyn Rosen, and myself, my wife, Alison Marsh. We need your prayers to keep on going because prayers make a difference. Your prayers make a difference. God bless you. Have a great Christmas. Have a great time with your family this New Year period. And the Lord bless you as we go forward together in 2017.